And here we go. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Whiskey Reaper channel. I see you. For all of you watching, welcome to the Benchmark Single Barrel Review. You know what? I've been meaning to do this one for a long time, but you know what? Oh, man, we're here now. I'm very excited to do this. Let me start the show by saying hello i see you for all of you watching hey if you have subscribed thank you for subscribing on this channel and also if you can hit me with an upvote button on this video it would really help out i do live streams weekly at 9 p.m you can go check them out and also when you go check them out you can send the super chat and i can add you to the next thumbnail for the next bottle we review but for today Hey, huge shout out to anybody that has been sending super chats on the live stream. You guys are amazing. And for today, we're going to be doing this beauty of a beauty benchmark single barrel, a 95 proof. Now, you're probably asking, why is this one of the ones that you're talking about? You're talking about being number one. Why is this on the screen? Let me show you exactly why. Okay. Distilled. Oh, shoot. We're going cockeyed point of matter is this still age and bottled in buffalo trace distillery kentucky yes 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 this is officially buffalo trace distillery juice and i think all of you already know who buffalo trace is <clears throat> they're the top they're the top whiskey distillery that just makes a huge amount of bourbon whiskey and probably the most trending bourbon whiskey that you can find in the USA. I'm not gonna take it away from any other company. There's a lot of other companies that are amazing that make a good amount of whiskeys and here here in the USA. But everybody wants a Buffalo Trace juice. Everybody wants something that comes out of Buffalo Trace. A lot of people also don't know about this, okay? They don't know that benchmark single barrel is actually from over there. And they think just because it's 20 something dollars it's not worth it, but it actually is. Let me talk to you more about it, but the moment, the moment we start talking about uh, more stuff, I'm going to pour myself a little bit, so allow me to pour just a little bit of this, and we're going to review this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful whiskey. Here we go. Let me tell you more about this. And for some of you that want to know about the price on this, it's a steal. It's a steal. It's an amazing steal. Let me just say this, okay? You're looking at about $26 for this. Yes, yes, yes. $26. I don't recommend you to pay $60 or $80 or $100. If you find this for $100, you're getting scammed. And for all of you, just beware. Beware. Beware before buying this. Know in fact that it's about 26 MSRP. You're usually the most you're probably gonna see is for 50 something dollars. And I really don't recommend you to buy this for 50 something dollars. There's a lot of bottles out there that are just fantastic for the $50 range. I'm not gonna take it away from this bottle. This bottle is extraordinary for the $26 you pay. You might be able to find it for $22. But I want to review this one because there's people on YouTube that actually do not know that this is actually an allocated bottle. Yeah, nobody on YouTube actually is telling you this, but I do know because the distributors are telling me that this is actually allocated. Out of all the ones in the benchmark line 
this is officially the only one that's actually allocated so if you find a lot of these in your shelf at least buy two because they're they're fantastic and they're supposed to be a little bit harder to find than maybe your standard uh, other maybe top floor maybe the uh, the bonded uh, the foolproof and the small batch it's supposed to be harder to find uh, but anyways this is a beautiful bottle i love the design but let's not talk about the design let's talk about how it's 95 proof and let's also talk about how we're going to review this right now hey let me say something for all of you watching ripper coat you know what time we're number one i try to only show you the best whiskeys for you so this is going to be in your realm okay so here we go let's nose this one out for all of you let's lick and sniff for all of you and let's make sure that we do a good good review for this because I don't think that there's even a review about this. Especially me telling you that it's an allocated product it's supposed to be. And it's supposed to be harder to find than any of them in the benchmark line. I love this in fact. I love it. I love it. I love it. Because it's $26. And sometimes I find this one for... I have a lot of these. But I think I have... I have seven of these bottles. I have them upstairs. Amazing, amazing juice. And for the price, you can't go wrong. Anyways, let's let's nose this one up. Here, okay. Let me let me do this. Here we go. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Let's try this benchmark single barrel. Oh, for a twenty-six dollar whiskey, coming out of Buffalo Trace, literally coming out of Buffalo Trace Distillery. This is everything you want in a very cheap, very good, very amazing, amazing, smooth, easy. Let me say this. If if I wanted to tell you guys something, the nose, the nose kind of reminds me of, uh, it kind of reminds me of uh, the regular Buffalo Trace bottling that they have. But the only difference is you have a little bit of different, different just a tad bit different stuff. I'm going to tell you right now, okay? You get just a tad, a tad bit of cherries. Okay, this one's this, there's a reason why I like this, is because it has cherries on the nose. You also get just a beautiful amount of just like a rye. You have a nice rye on here. You have a nice, nice rye, rye, just, just, just rye of spice on here, but it's not too much. You can tell you have cinnamon on here too. Caramel, caramel is outstanding. It's just, it's it's almost like the caramel on here. It's almost like you can tell that this this is. Well, actually, you can tell when you're nosing this. You're not going to be able to tell if this is an expensive bottle or it's cheap. You're not going to be able to tell. Knowing in fact that that caramel elevates this nose, it makes it nice and rich. Even though it isn't, it isn't. A, uh, it's not rich. It's it's. You can tell. Look, let me show you. Let me show you. Okay, you can see, you can see it's a lighter color, and uh, I don't know if you can tell the legs. You got some legs on here for a twenty-something dollar whiskey. Look at that, man! Come on, man! Come on, man! Come on, twenty-something dollars! Come on, man! By the way, this is like a daily drinker, but it's outstanding. It's it's above and beyond. Point of the matter is, back on this nose, you you do get a little bit of a. A little bit of fruits on the nose, a little bit of caramel, and uh, just the spices. You get spices, nice spices, not too overwhelming. Anyways, the point of the matter is, hey, I gotta go on to this. I gotta go and tell you how this tastes like. So cheers, cheers, cheers. Here we go. Cheers, all of you. Ripper crew, I see you. Let's try this one out. Let's go deep in here. Here we go. Oh, oh man! Oh, off the off the ring, off the ring, off the ring, off the ring! I get the cinnamon, cinnamon just just flowing through, cinnamon flowing through caramel, beautiful, beautiful amount of caramel. I get a little bit of vanilla too, a tad bit of vanilla on here, not too much, not too much. I do get a little bit of tad bit of apples on here also tad bit of apples i'm gonna go on here and i'm gonna try this one one more time here we go one more time let's try this one out oh 
You get a you get a good amount of cherries, a good amount of cherries, cherries and apples, cherries and apples. Yes, cherries and apples. I really like it. The oak no on here is perfect. It is just perfect, man. Ninety five proof. You can tell that I could want a second pour. I would want a second dram. Okay, this is I know in fact it's twenty six dollars. So for me. Let me tell you this, for me, if I know that it's $26, I abuse a little bit more, you know? If, if it's an expensive bottle, I don't. I want to take it slowly. And when I say abuse, calm down, okay? I'm not, please, please, drink responsible. Please drink responsible. What I mean is, I'll probably drink the first glass fast if I know it's cheap. And then the second glass, I'll take it easy. I'll know, in fact, that I can buy another one of these bottles. It's not as rare as maybe, uh, you know, something that's $500 or $400 or $300. You understand? It's a different feeling when you're a whiskey drinker. You buy the whiskeys and you have an expensive whiskey. You don't want to You don't wanna be uh, overpouring with an expensive whiskey because to find it again is hard. You understand what I mean? Ho hopefully, hopefully you guys at home, I see you. Hopefully you guys at home understand what I'm talking about. Because, you know, $200 is $200. $26 is $26. You know what I mean? This is fantastic. This is outstanding. I'm going to go for this one again. It does taste like it's 94, uh, 95 proof. Again, I did tell you the proofing on this. 95 proof. And it does taste... It doesn't taste overwhelmingly too, too high. It doesn't taste over... It's perfect. This is perfect. I'm going I'm to take a sip again. One more time. Let's go. Let's try this out one more time. This is just so... This is so good, man. You're paying $26? You got to be, be kidding me right now. You get a little bit of pepper notes on here now. I'm starting to get the pepper notes on here. The caramels are still there. The cinnamon pop is still there. The oak note is very much lingering on here. It is just excellent. It is outstanding. It is one of a kind. And I'm going to tell you the best part about this is also the finish. You have a pretty good finish. The oak note on the finish. It's not too dry, but it's a tad bit dry. Very nice. And at the end of the day, this is a perfect, well-balanced whiskey. Yes, yes, yes. This is a well-balanced, perfect bourbon whiskey that you're paying $26 for. Now, if you're watching anybody on if you're watching anybody on YouTube, let me tell you this. A lot of people are snobs on YouTube. There's a lot of nerds, okay? Ah oh, man, there's so many nerds on YouTube. The fact is, they don't know how to compare a $26 whiskey compared to a $300 whiskey. That's where I come in. I can tell you, in fact, this is outstanding because you're paying $26. And if anybody tells you that this is a horrible whiskey, it's because they're thinking about a $200 bottle. They're taking. They're thinking about it like a Stag Junior. They probably have Stag Junior. Oh, man, the Stag. Oh, the Stag. Man, forget the Stag. Forget the Stag. $26. Maybe uh, if you get lucky, you find this for an expensive amount. The point of the matter is, you have an amazing whiskey here. Benchmark. Yes, yes, yes. And the best part about this, I'm going to take the last sip on here. Mm. Oh, man. That is outstanding. That is, that is just outstanding. I can't talk to you more about this. For a $26 bottle, that's a banger. The best part about this is that this is a single barrel. Yes, yes, yes. And if you're probably asking, what is a single barrel? You're a newbie. You don't know. Well, each and every one of these bottles, and most of the time, single barrel. If you see that somebody says, if you see your whiskey that says single barrel, most of the time, it comes from only one barrel. So your bottle might taste different than maybe a bottle that you buy next year. If you find one next year and you find one this year, you find one at the end of the year, it might taste a little bit different. Just a tad bit different. Nothing too crazy to the point that you're gonna be like, Wow, this is this is this is this is not the same whiskey. It's not gonna be like that. You're just gonna have a little bit of a just a slight bit of a difference. Sometimes you're gonna get more dominant notes. On maybe the cinnamon, maybe you're going to get more dominant notes on the fruits. The single barrels is where it's at because you get a personal, personal, personal bottle. 
And that's why I tell you this is a win. So beware, beware before buying, okay? Beware. If this, if this, you see this over $26, beware. Buy the whole shelf. These are outstanding to have at home, at your bar. And for all of you watching, hey, this is a review for all of you. Hey, I hope you enjoyed this review. I'm going to give huge shout outs to anybody that's been watching the live streams. I see you. All the people that have been sending me super chats and supporting the channel. Thank you so much. Huge shout outs to the USA. Huge shout outs to Ripper Crew. I see you, Ripper Crew. We're number one. Huge shout outs to the US Army, US Marines, US Air Force, US Navy. And let's not forget about the Space Force. Yes, yes, yes. They're over there battling the aliens. By the way, I will tell you. Shout out to Bitcoin. Shout out to Bitcoin. Shout out to XRP. And shout out to you. You are the big one here because you're watching and you're giving me the thumbs up and you subscribe. So shout out to you. Get yourself a benchmark. Single barrel. This is an amazing review. I hope you enjoy the bottle. And hey. I'll see you all on the next one. Let's do this one one more time. Ripper Crew, we are, we're number